it's that gratitude guy, David George Brook. Internet trolls. I guess I should look at my internet trolls as a sign that I am getting better known. I mean, after all, isn't that a goal to get better known on the internet? I post videos about gratitude several times a week to get the message out to as many people as possible. I figured the more people that know about its immense power, the better. However, it took me a long time to truly understand the mindset of an internet troll. Originally, I was mad because I thought, how dare they criticize me because I'm trying to put good content out there for the world. Because I speak and teach about gratitude, that very mindset, the attitude of gratitude, helped me to really have empathy for the trolls. Why? Well, it is so easy to sit back at your anonymous computer and take shots at anyone and everyone that you feel needs your cryptic comments. They take great pride in their anonymity, just like yelling insults from a moving car. Would you say those things if you weren't in a speeding car? I think it's called false courage. Gratitude made me learn to appreciate what I have in life. One of the things I have is a desire to help people and to make a difference. That feeling you get from helping someone is priceless. You just can't put a price on it. An internet troll will never know that feeling. Instead, the content creators will always adhere to what Teddy Roosevelt said so eloquently. Quote, it is not the critic who counts, not the man who points out how strong men stumble or where the doer of deeds could have done them better. The credit belongs to the man who is actually in the arena, whose face is marred by dust and sweat and blood, who strives valiantly, who errs, who comes up short again and again because there is no effort without error and shortcoming, but who does actually strive to do the deeds, who knows great enthusiasms, the great devotions, who spends himself in a worthy cause, who at the best knows in the end the triumph of high achievement, and who at the worst, if he fails, at least he fails while daring greatly, so that his place shall never be with those cold and timid souls who neither know victory nor defeat. To all of the rest of you, I'm humbled and grateful for your support. Lastly, if you want to get more gratitude into your life, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel by clicking on the subscribe button in the lower right-hand corner. And don't forget to click on the bell so you get a notice of whenever I post a new video. Thank you so much. God bless you all. I'm that gratitude guy. Remember, be grateful and never quit.